Hello guys, welcome back to my channel, The Machine Guy. In previous lecture, we were discussed how to install VECA software and brief introduction about the VECA software tools. Sorry, VECA software interface. Okay. Today, we will discuss how to convert XLS file to CSV and a CSV file to ARFF by using VECA software. Okay. First, we will discuss how to convert CSV to, sorry, XLS file to CSV. Okay. Here, first, to save an excel file in csv format here are some steps okay to save this excel file into csv format we should follow some of the step, steps okay first in your workbook switch to the targeted worksheet as the active sheet will be converted okay first you need to enter into the workbook or any excel sheets okay on on the file tab click save as okay we will go these steps into in a practical form okay first go to file or any open any kind of um, Excel sheets. I have some of Excel sheets. I'll show you. Okay. These are the Excel sheets of interview candidates. Okay. First, we'll we'll take some of information and we don't want this. Okay. Take some of information and save it in new Excel. and open new excel sheet or new workbook and paste this is the um, new workbook in excel sheet okay but then you need to save this excel sheet save in uh, save in desktop okay uh, take one folder as take folder as document sorry um, data And save this in this data okay. Okay, here these interview candidates will be saved in the form of XLS or XLS XLXX format. Okay, here XLS the main differences between XLS and XLS is the XLS is the Microsoft format, okay, and XLSX is the XML based open file format, okay. And we need to convert into CSV format that is comma separated value. For that, for that, you need to go file and press save as. Go to file located place. Here is the book one dot xls right. So you need to convert into CSV format. Take a CSV comma delimiter as file extension and save it. And uh, it will remove uh, some of the formats okay format painters okay yes yes so for that we need to check whether the file is converted into csv format or not that we will save already in data format here is the csv format for that press open with notepad so here are the data candidates and it is separated by the comma delimiter okay so we successfully converted into xls file to csv now by using VECA software tool we need to convert csv file to arff okay here arff means attribute relational file format okay we need to convert comma separated value into the attribute relational file format for that first you need to open first you need to open VECA gui chooser and then click the tool button in the top menu bar okay First, you need to go to the record GA chooser and then press the tool button in top menu. After that, click on the ARFF viewer. Okay. After that, I will show you this is the record software tool, a 3.8.6 version. Okay. Uh, this is the top uh, toolbar in menu bar. Okay. This is the tool and click ARFF viewer. Okay. And then after, after we need to choose file format to be loaded like .csv okay after that open .csv file to the view the data and values and then name the file with arff extension and then last we need to save this file okay let's press file and open where we stored we were stored in a desktop okay so this is the data we need to change into csv okay this is the csv file 
then we need to convert it into ARFF format. Okay. So if you want any edits here, you can able to change it. Okay. Go to file and then save as as ARFF viewer. Okay. Mark it as data one. Okay. Press save. Okay. This is the data set of ARFF file. Okay. So we were successfully converted into CSV file to ARFF file format. Okay. And then if you want to open or if you want to reprocess, um, if you want to visualize or classify cluster associated data, go to Veka Explorer and then open file. Go to desktop and you need to open this ARFF file. Okay. Here we can able to classify cluster and associate select attributes and can visualize the data. So that's all about this video and from next video we will unsupervise the attributes by using discretizer. Okay. So that's all about this lecture. Please like, share and subscribe. Thank you.